If you're struggling to model a 3D character, this software is for you. MakeHuman will help you to create in a few minutes a human model built with an ideal geometry for animation. It's totally free and you can get it now by clicking the link in the description. I will skip the installation of the software, it's pretty much easy to do and you should be able to do it yourself. After opening MakeHuman, this interface will show up. I purposely put clothes on the model because of the YouTube guideline, but in your screen it will appear naked. You can navigate freely in the viewport to turn around the model and zoom in and zoom out. And don't worry, you can click anywhere, it's safe, nothing bad will happen. So if you're familiar with some type of video games where you can customize your character, know that is pretty much the same thing here. The modeling tab is where you are going to build your character. I will be brief here because this phase is personal and we all have different tastes in terms of creation. But I will get your attention on some options to help yourself. On main, you can define the identity of your character. As you can see, MakeHuman has a sliding system buttons to set up each criteria among the tons of possibility. On gender, you'll be free to define the private attribute of your character. Because of YouTube guidelines, I won't cover that part. But be sure to also check this side of the viewport on each tab for more customizable parts. Like for the face tab, you have plenty of options to tweak and so on with the torso, arms and legs. At this stage, feel free to play with the settings. If you have hard time to balance your characters properly, know that you have some symmetry tools here to help. And that's pretty much it. The other tabs don't really matter. So to follow me for the rigging part, I would suggest you to keep your model by default, naked, without clothes, eyes, hair, nothing else. Trust me. It's better to do it with non-additional stuff for the success of the tutorial. And please, don't add the make human rig on it, because the one that you will put in Blender is way more better. When you're done, just save your project, then export it into a Colada format, or DAE. Now you can open Blender, create a new general scene, delete the cube, then go to File, Import, Colada format or DAE, locate your file and import it. Your character should be successfully imported inside Blender. And I hope it really does it for you. In the next episode, I will show you how to rig this character. I hope you enjoyed this tour of MakeHuman. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Cheers.